On this week's episode of Scientific Tuesdays, we're gonna make our own smoke bombs. Company Hope! Tin foil? Sir, yes, sir! Ping pong ball? Aye, Captain! Lighter and scissors? Here. So take your ping pong ball and poke a small hole in it, and then proceed to cut it in half. If you want the best effect, you'll do this with about three to four ping pong balls. Be very careful. Once you have that done, put them into a blender, or you can keep cutting them up if you want. When you're done, you should have little shards of ping pong ball. Dump them all onto a tin foil layout. Carefully wrap the tin foil around the ping pong ball shards. Insert a pen in the end because you want to leave a hole for air to get out when we're all done. Just like this. So now that I have the pen there, I'm going to wrap the tin foil all around the shards. Crunch it up and make sure no air is getting in from the bottom. When you're done, it should look something like this. And here it is in all its glory. Okay, so let's test this thing out. Now make sure you don't breathe this in because it's smoke and smoke's not good to inhale. So stand clear once you light it. Hold a lighter up to the bottom until it heats up. Eventually smoke's gonna start pouring out of it. This is basically because once you start burning ping pong ball shards, it turns into a small gas and emits smoke all over the place. Pretty cool, huh? See you next week.